2018 BMW M5 First Drive Review, Power Meets Traction. Lisbon, Portugal, from a brace of inline sixes, to naturally aspirated V8 S and V10 S, and all the way to today's twin turbocharged beasts, the BMW M5 has always shared one defining characteristic, rear wheel drive. That's no longer the case, and purists are raising their brows. After all, big power plus rear drive equals smoky tail out antics of the first degree. To those eyebrow archers, we have good news. BMW knows the M5 must remain an emulator of tires, and it has the hardware bits and software bytes to make sure all-wheel drive isn't a death sentence for fun. BMW's MX drive system allows all of the M5 600 horsepower and 553 pounds feet of torque to claw enough traction to accelerate from 0 60 miles per hour in 3.2 seconds and to 124 miles per hour in 11.1 seconds. That makes the latest M5 the quickest yet. Four-wheel drive traction has its advantages. And if your battle cry is death to all rubber, you can always switch the M5 into rear-wheel drive mode using the appropriate buttons from inside the cabin. Again, purists may look at the smorgasbord of buttons, dials, and screens inside the 2018 M5 and wonder how we got here, especially compared to something as straightforward as the benchmark E39. The answer is the constant pursuit of performance. It's easy to stick 600 plus ponies in a sedan, and the result is going to be a hellish riot. The hard part is making them hook up and do what you want. Enter the bright red M1 and M2 buttons on the steering wheel that allow the driver to customize two preferred driving modes. The engine can be set to Efficient, Sport, and Sport Plus, the suspension and steering have Comfort, Sport, and Sport Plus modes, also accessible via a series of buttons on the center console. There's a new version of BMW's shift stock that confused us at first, with left-right detents for drive and reverse. But as much as we like to complain about the unnecessary reinvention of the shifter, owners will surely get used to it quickly. Parked side by side, the new M5 looks taller and more refined than the old. A carbon fiber roof removes weight right where you don't want it, and, combined with a new lighter weight exhaust system, makes the new M5 less portly than its predecessor. The familiar kidney grills are large as are the three lower air intakes. Squared off and scrunched down versions of BMW's long-running halo headlights keep things looking fresh, and the four creases in the aluminum hood add aggression and hint at the power developed within.